Hello and welcome to All Ladies Church in Aikum for our Friday evening prayer. Uh, and you join us uh, in this diocese on the feast of the dedication of our cathedral church in Middlesbrough. In every Catholic diocese worldwide, the anniversary of the cathedral's dedication to God is observed in a special way. And that's because the cathedral is our mother church and the bishop is the leader of the local church here in Middlesbrough. Uh, the bishop is our father in God. But the annual observance of the cathedral's dedication isn't about a building. It celebrates the mystery that the Church of God is made up of, of living stones. And the image that you'll have uh, on your screen uh, shows some of the living stones of which our parish here uh, at Our Lady is, is made up of, members of our parish community, the people who are through their life, their love and their service are building up uh, the church in this part of the diocese, in this part of the wider church. So our cathedral is in Middlesbrough, that's the family we belong to, and we pray today in a special way for our Bishop Terence Patrick and for all the people of God in this diocese. The different parish communities that make up the diocese exist to serve and to make visible God's love for all people. So as we recall with thanks the day our cathedral was dedicated to God's service, may Christ's command to serve grow in our hearts and in our minds. And so we move now to our evening prayer. Christ is our peace. He has broken down the hostility between us. There is neither Jew nor Greek, slave nor free, male nor female. We are all one in Christ Jesus. God was in Christ reconciling the world with himself and has enlisted us in this service of reconciliation. We are the body of Christ and are members of one another. We are a community of the Holy Spirit, called to be witnesses of God's love. But because we do not always live in the peace which God intends, let us remember in silence now our own faults and failings. May the peace of God be with us and may we forgive one another and ourselves as God forgives us. Yeah.
from the prophet Isaiah. God says, I will bring them to my holy mountain. I will make them joyful in my house of prayer. The holocausts and their sacrifices will be accepted on my altar. For my house will be called a house of prayer for all peoples. So let us pray then for those who need to be remembered today. And each one of us will have people that we want to pray for and this time. So don't think that these um, headings are, are exclusive, but bring your own prayers. Um, bring your own prayers in your hearts to God at this moment. We pray for those who are in the news headlines because of what they have said or done. And for those who should be in the news headlines because of what they say or do are signs of hope. We pray for those who we know will have difficulty in coping with themselves today. And for those who are in hospital, in prison, in care, or in a place which is strange to them, for those agonizing over a decision they have to make. For those whom the words peace and justice bring to mind. for any other special person or situation. And for ourselves. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. So before we have our closing blessing prayer, thank you for being with us this evening for this short time of prayer on this beautiful feast of the family of God in this local church in Middlesbrough. Pray that God will give you a peaceful night and keep you and your loved ones safe. And the parish community will gather again on Sunday morning at 10 o'clock for our celebration of Sunday Mass. You're very welcome to join us then if you're able to do so. 
O Trinity of Love, you have been with us at the world's beginning. Be with us till the world's end. You have been with us at our life's shaping. Be with us at our life's end. You have been with us at the sun's rising. Be with us till the day's end. And let us go now in peace, in the joy of the risen Christ. For God is with us. Hallelujah.